Creatures of Scenario has updated and in this update they've added in two of these brand new creatures one of them being a secret mission creature so um yeah let's go ahead and check them out. Okay, so as you can see, these are the two brand new creatures, and I do not have them yet. I did buy a stored one of each of them just to showcase for you guys, and I will be trying to trade for these species later. But as you can see, this is the Sharuk, and then this, I'm just going to call it the Jester creature since the name is, um, the name is kind of wonky. But um, yeah, so the Sharuk is the secret mission creature, and then the Jester creature, you can get it from the royalty gacha, and um, yeah, let's go ahead and show you guys. Okay, so first things first, the Jester creature. To get the Jester creature, you want to go to shop and then go to gachas, and it'll be inside of the royalty gacha, and you'll have a 20% chance to get it with 10 tickets. And if you guys don't know how to get tickets, well, basically tickets, you can either buy them straight up with Robux, or you can convert your mushrooms into tickets it is 800 mushrooms for one ticket and the final option is to sell your species so as you can see right here you can sell your species if you reach 25 of them you get one ticket so yeah you got to sell 25 species to get one ticket so um yeah 10 tickets that is going to be a lot of species so um yeah those are the only ways to get tickets and um, now let's go ahead and go into the next creature. Okay, so now let's go ahead and show you guys how to get the Sharuk. So as you can see, the Sharuk has probably got to be one of the most unique creatures. They have added it in a while, and I'll show you guys why in a bit. But as you can see, the Sharuk, let's go ahead. You, what you want to do is go to missions and scroll all the way down until you see the Sharuk mission. And again, it is a secret mission creature, so they won't actually reveal the missions to you guys. But I can tell you guys all the missions since everyone has worked together and already figured it out. So the first mission is you need to travel 20,000 studs as a terrestrial creature at night. Alright guys, I'll put an image on the screen right now of the missions. And then the second mission is kill 5 creatures during a blood moon. And you can kill any tier creature and you, you can be any tier creature so there really is no limit to that. Just make sure you kill 5 creatures during a blood moon. And then the final mission is survive five nights. So yeah, you just got to survive five nights. And um, yeah, that is pretty much it. And once you do that, you will be able to get the Sharuk for free. And yeah, um, that, is, that is honestly, that's pretty much it to get this creature. It's just going to take some time to do the missions. But um, yeah, that is pretty much it. Okay, so here is the Jester creature. And let's go ahead and check out these stats. So as you can see, it has the health of 3,200. It does 80 damage and it takes 27 minutes to grow. Here are all the passive effects, as you can see right here, and the active abilities. And as you can see, it has some pretty insane active abilities, and it has a lot of abilities. Okay, so here is the Sharuk, and now let's go ahead and check out these stats. So as you can see, it has 6,150 HP. It does 335 damage. It takes 50 minutes to grow, and here are the passive effects and the active abilities. And yeah, there we go. But the very unique thing about this creature is that it changes its face depending on your gender so if you're a male this is what you're going to look like and if you're a female that is what your face is going to look like so there's a big difference with this creature so yeah that is pretty cool okay so here is the jester creature and let's go ahead and check out these stats so as you can see it has the health of 3200 it does 80 damage and it takes 27 minutes to grow here are all the passive effects as you can see right here and the active abilities and as you can see it has some pretty insane active abilities and it has a lot of abilities okay so here is the sharuk and now let's go ahead and check out these stats so as you can see it has 6150 hp it is 335 damage it takes 50 minutes to grow and here's the passive effects and the active abilities and yeah there we go but the very unique thing about this creature is that it changes its face depending on your gender so if you're a male this is what you're going to look like and if you're a female that is what your face is going to look like so there's a big difference with this creature from disquit distinguishing either if it's a male or female so yeah that is pretty cool all right guys so we have spawned into the server as the sharuk and look at this thing guys holy cow the face is absolutely scary, I'm not even going to lie, and it is very, very menacing. And I believe the female face is actually, honestly, I, the female face is a lot scarier. And did you guys just see that? The idle animation, it like twitches its head, which is just, that is just absolutely creepy. But yeah, guys, like, look, look at that, it twitches. 
that is that, that is just creepy but um yeah let's go ahead and check out the walkie animation here's the walkie animation and then the sprinty animation oh my gosh just look at this imagine this just chasing you and you're just like a little puff lump holy cow yeah that is scary but um yeah let's go ahead and do the z animation now and let's see what the z animation oh, wait what the heck wait did it just pull its mask off okay wait i i i thought the mask was its face wait what it, it's just a mask okay guys i i honestly thought it was the face but i guess um um the, it's just a mask okay that 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 is unexpected i i did not expect that okay so let's go ahead and do the x animation holy cow okay so it, it, it's just a mask it's just a mask and then now let's do the end animation there we go and again it's twitching that is that is creepy and then to the sitting animation now and then the sleeping animation and there we go those are all the animations for this creature and this creature honestly has pretty good stats having 6150 hp and 335 damage when fully grown along with its insane abilities but um yeah guys that is pretty much it for the sharuk and again honestly the female face is a lot scarier in my opinion but um yeah let's go ahead and check out the jester creature okay so now we have spawned in as the jester creature and look at this thing it is pretty cool and it is a very very tiny creature um and for the arms it does have heads look at this look at the walking animation it's just like dragging uh its arms on the floor and the really unique thing about this creature has definitely got to be the arms like look at those heads that is so weird look at that okay let's go ahead and check out the animation so here's the sprinting animation right here there we go and then let's go ahead and do the Z animation. There we go. And then the X animation. And then the N animation. Oh, look at that. This one's actually really nice. Oh, and there's a good live class tornado. All right, and then let's do the R animation for the city animation. And then the sleepy animation. There we go, guys. And something immense is approaching. I wonder what it could be. It is probably the tornado. But anyway, guys, this creature is extremely fast. Like, look at this thing. It is pretty fast. And I believe if you use ambush or speed steal, yes, speed steal, you can steal. Oh, I got picked up by the tornado. Okay, okay, we're in the tornado. All right, we gotta click to escape. All right, ho luckily I'm a fast clicker. Oh, oh gosh, I just got launched. And this creature is um. It's, it's not so good at swimming. But um, yeah, guys, that is pretty much it for this video. I hope you guys did enjoy. And be sure to tell me in the comments, do you guys prefer the Jester creature or the Sharuk more? Me, I personally prefer the Sharuk. The Sharuk is just honestly way creepier. And it's just a very unique creature on its own. But um, yeah, guys, I'll see you all in the next video. Peace out.